This is a journey to meet the archetypes. Bring yourself to the edge of a meadow. Look down and notice if you're wearing shoes. And then find the path that takes you through the meadow to the forest in the distance. And when you reach the edge of that meadow, there's a clear running stream where you can wash your hands and face. Stepping over the stream, find yourself in the forest and look around you for a place where you can enter the earth. It could be a hole, an animal hole, a cave, a hollow tree trunk. Find that place now. And stepping into the earth, past the roots of the great trees, past the bedrock of the earth, until you reach an underground river. And this is a place where you can submerge your body and just release any heaviness that you're holding into the earth, into the water. Release anything that you don't want to take into the domains of the soul. And let that water carry you down, deep, deep down.
thanking Serpent for her gifts, her messages, and the experience of becoming her, and feeling what it's like to be soft belly on the earth. You're walking through the jungle once more, and you can call on Jaguar now, the medicine and the energy of Jaguar who has no fear of de death from this life to the next. Calling on Otorongo, you hear a padding behind you. Maybe Jaguar leaps down from a branch and you look into Jaguar's eyes and somehow you become Jaguar with that beautiful fur, that dark, glimmering fur and those piercing eyes and that silent tracking the padding of the feet and ask Jaguar Otorongo to take you now into the jungle and move with her what heaviness needs to be mulched into Pachamama where do you need peace or clarity and what are you scared of releasing help her Ask for her help doing this. She will help you with transition. So prowl with your Jaguar for a little while now and see where she wants to take you. Smell her warm breath and feel her whiskers. Is there a message, a word, an image or a feeling with this experience? Take a moment now to journey wherever you're guided with Jaguar. Ready, thanking Jaguar for her guidance, for her support on your journey in the medicine wheel. And as she leaves your body and you keep on walking in the, jung in the jungle, you call in the medicine and the energy of Hummingbird. She will help you to sip the nectar of life in every moment. Where is your soul calling you? Watch the hummingbird as it flies over the flowers, the beautiful, tropical, colourful flowers in the distance. They move backwards, forwards, sideways, all different directions, and they use their long tongue to sip that nectar so they can be still as they're sipping. As you become so engaged with watching Hummingbird, you know that you can actually become Hummingbird and experience what it's like to have those beautiful iridescent wings hovering very, very fast. And that tongue and that way of knowing where the nectar is in every moment. So ask Hummingbird, where is my soul calling me? How can I look at a difficult situation more creatively? Be with Hummingbird now for a little while. See where she wants to take you and watch as she hovers above a flower and become her, moving sideways, forwards, backwards, sipping nectar. Is there a message, a word? an image or feeling associated with her journey. Let her show you some magic, some wonder. Take a moment to journey where you're guided with Hummingbird and experience her magic, her sweetness, her name. 
Nektar. she wants to take you. Is there a message, a word, an image, a feeling connected to your experience? Just take a moment now to journey wherever you're
make your way back to the gateway and to Waskar. Back the way you came, through the cloud forest, through the jungle, to the gateway. Ask him, is there anything I need to express that's below the surface? Look into his eyes and be with him for a little while now. See where he wants to take you. Is there a message, a word, an image or a feeling associated with your experience with Waskar? Take a moment now to journey with Waskar. Making your way back to the shores where you entered and dive into the waters, allowing them to bring you to the place where you rested and submerged your body for the first time. Relax here once more, letting the waters refresh you as you prepare to return to our world. Beginning your journey back up through the bedrock, past the roots of the great trees, the giant boulders and the rich, moist soil, into the forest and then over that clear running stream where you can wash your face and hands once more and back along the path in the meadow to the place where you began this journey. Return to your space, your living space, and into your body. Take a deep breath and open your eyes, feeling fully refreshed and renewed. Experience the sense of belonging and walking with beauty on the earth that results from discovering that you've never left Eden. And make some notes about your connections with each archetype.